Good afternoon, my name is Hanan Bujami and I will be bringing to you Diplo Briefing for the month of July 2019. Uh, innovative business startups from the MENA region could receive a cash injection of up to $1 million um, as a part of a newly launched um, initiative by a foundation called MISC. So these technology startups will be given the opportunity to participate in a three-month uh, program um, the MISC Foundation has launched this uh, accelerator scheme uh, for uh, companies in the region um, with other investors such as Seed Stars and Vision uh, Ventures. So each company selected to take part uh, in the project will receive an initial $100,000 with the chance of a follow-up up to $1 million. On another news, Apple uh, finally is to launch an Arabic-only app store so uh, the service is up for, I think, launch uh, next September. Um, it's a part of their bid to uh, tap into the Middle East uh, technology market. Uh, so the um, number of Arabic-specific apps remains small, um, but Apple hopes to um, grow in the market as the technology um, evolves. So the Arabic language only store is available uh, to subscribe developers and members of the app uh, beta software programs. These groups of the developers will test the new system before its launch to the general public and uh, this launch will also coincide with uh, the release of Apple's latest operating software iOS 13. And last but not least, uh, Emirates Integrated Telecommunication Company, I, um, EITC, has become the regional founding member of the Light Communications Alliance. It's a newly launched global consortium of communications, lighting infrastructure, and device manufacturing industry leaders. The consortium aims at promoting new wireless technologies to enable light communications. So the LCA will also establish and advocate the use of global standards of this emerging industry. That's all for me. Thank you very much for your attention and see you next time.